Welcome to the Book Merchants, my friend. I'm Stuart, Sales and Marketing Executive. And at the Book Merchants, we are the local agents for Scholastic International. Now, I know it's time for you to make that daunting list, that book list that you have to give to your parents and make sure that they go and get the books. But don't worry, I know things are rough in the pandemic. I can't get to come and see you. You can't get to talk to me about the books that you want. But Book Merchant is here. So I'm here to make a simple presentation to you because you must create that book list. And on your book list, primarily for prime mathematics as it relates to grades five and six, as you know, the government would have supplied all primary schools, all 760 primary schools throughout the island with the course books, right? So the course book, again, the foundation book, is to introduce and develop the concepts with your students. This one is for grades five, and likewise we have for grade six, and as you note, ministry approved, according to the NSC. In addition to um, your book list, your supplemental book list, now you need to know what is best for your students. Now you would have been supplied with the course book, you want the right fit, and the right fit is your practice book. Now this is what you add to your students' book list that you give to the parents for them to go to the bookstores to get. Now the practice book, I'm happy to report, is fully aligned to the curriculum, has the performance tests, the abilities tests, as well as the curriculum based test questions. And don't worry, the answers are also provided at the back for you. All right, you can instruct your students to take them out. In addition to the arsenal of resources for mathematics for grades five and six, of course, we can't leave you out because we understand how daunting sometimes teaching mathematics can be. Now, we have what is called the teacher's guide. Here's a copy for grades six. Likewise, we have for grades five. Don't worry, you can tell your colleagues that the other grades are available from grades K right through, all right? Now, what are some of the critical features of this program? One, your teacher's guides. Your teacher's guides has what is called the developmental continuum. And this is where you're able to trace what your students should have covered from grades four, what must be covered in grade five, and then what's gonna flow in grade six. And you'll notice that your strands are listed right across. In addition to your teacher's guides, look at all of that work that we put in for you. Wow, we've been busy. In addition to your teacher's guides, you'll notice something called a scheme of work. The modern day language is your lesson plan, yes? And so with your lesson plan, here, it acts as a guide so that you can construct your own lesson plan. And it gives you the material, the objectives, the units, the vocabulary that you need to use with your students to ensure that they understand completely what it is that you're teaching. So any day you walk into your classroom and you see your colleagues with a book turned this way, you know what take place. You know that they're doing their lesson plans. In addition to your teacher's guides, again, what it does, it mirrors the course book for you. So the course book information is embedded in there. So you go to page one of your course book, you'll notice that it's mirrored inside of the teacher's guides. And what it does too, again, it outlines the, the lesson plan for you. It tells you what to say, what you write, and what you should be asking the students because you want to make sure that you're asking all the right questions, you're making sure that you're testing them, and you're making sure that you are covering all of the, of, of the areas that need to be covered. Now, also with your teacher's guides, you want to flip to the back because what I hear a lot is that teachers don't have enough resources now, not having enough resources can be a problem. And with Prime, our intention is problem solving. Now, how do we pro uh, solve this problem? Simple, we give you the resources. So you go to the back here and you see all these resources. When you're teaching your topic, it will tell you what page to go to. And don't worry, my friends, you can photocopy, or the word I learned in Montego Bay is photoscopy. So you can photoscopy until you're weak, all right? Now you can do that and give it to your students. Now. I do understand, I do understand that we are having some challenging times, some abnormal times, things that we have never experienced before. So how are you expected to teach at a time like this when you have to social distance? Your students have to be away from you. You can't really monitor what it is that you're doing and, and, and ensure that they're 
grasping the concept as they would in a face-to-face -face setting. I'm happy to report that AMP, one of our flagship workshop program, is still on. Unfortunately, we can't do it face-to-face. -face. I would have loved to have you at Shortwood Teachers College for the three days. Of course, very exciting, exciting time having you learning and having you engaging and, 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 and seeing your colleagues from long time days. Unfortunately, that's not going to happen this year. However, the fix to that as problem solvers is that we're going to be doing this online. So come August 25th through to the 27th, we're going to be hosting AMP virtually. Listen out, look out, check your emails, check your phones. We're going to be sending out the save the dates. You can register early so that you are a part of the, of, of the group of teachers who will be participating in these online sessions. We have trainers from Puerto Rico. We have our resident trainer from Singapore, Kelly Lim. We have trainers from Mexico, Canada. Of course, we're going to have our grassroots Jamaican trainers. Um, but just join us. Join us. If you have any questions, if you, if you have any concerns, please feel free to get in touch with us. Our number is 876-946-0926. In, email us at info at bookmerchant.net. Keep safe, be good, and God bless.